My name is Caleb, and this is Jig and Minnow Outdoors. I'm an avid hunter and fisherman. I love going fishing, I love going hunting. I don't just shoot to kill, I shoot to provide meat, and so does my family. If there's a fish that swims, I will try to catch it. I will try to do that. And that's what I'm going to do on this channel. This is Jig and Minnow Outdoors. Hello everybody, I'm Caleb, and this is the Jig and Meadow Outdoors YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to teach you how to tie a standard fishing knot um, the way my family does it. Uh, it is just a trusty fishing knot. It doesn't ever really come undone unless you don't, if you tie it not properly, then it will uh, most likely come undone. If you do it right, very handy, will come, or it will hold up very well. Okay, what we're gonna need for this, um, I just used an old hook here old little jig head I found, uh, use that for an example, just some line here, old line I found in my tackle box, and then just some pliers just to clip off that line. And um, yeah, I'm going to switch over the camera here quickly, and we'll get started on a kind of a different point of view here. Okay, to start it off here, we got a, got a hook, some clear line, like I said before, old stuff I found in my tackle box. First thing we're going to do here is we're going to put that little piece of line through the eyelet and then pull it so we got a pretty long tail. And trust me, you'll want a long tail. And then you're going to wrap that over and just cross it over and then make another loop as you see on the screen right now. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to start wrapping that around that main line. The tail, you're going to wrap the tail around the main line about eight times. Um, it doesn't really matter how many you do, you just want it to be at least over seven or eight. Um, and yeah, we'll put this in speedy up or whatever. And then once you got that done, as you can see, all that's all wrapped around. And then what you're going to want to do is take that tail and put it through the first loop we made. That, yeah, the first loop we made. And then put that tail through the loop that it made. I know it's kind of complicated. Uh, if you're following along, I hope this wasn't too fast. But um, And then, uh, yeah, you're just going to give that a pretty good pull until it starts tightening up. And as you can see now, the, the knots start to stack on each other. And it creates a whole bunch of little knots on it, which is really good. It's a trusty knot. And, yeah, it is just a really good knot. I would highly suggest using it. And, uh, yeah, so and then we're just going to clip off the tail. And if you like this, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And then I'll do more, maybe a fly fishing even. If this ends up getting enough likes, we'll say like three likes, maybe three or four. And I'll do a fly fishing knot tying video thing. That is yeah. a basic fishing knot for you guys. Yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoy it.